Hi everyone and welcome back to another edition of Macam and Ty. This is part two of the video uh, about the Chez condominium uh, and my friend Gary from Australia who kindly led us uh, into his condo to have a look around. This is part two where we sat down and had a chat about the process involved in him finally getting the condo that he's in now. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do so. If you've got any comments, good or bad, please put them below. And if you've got any ideas for any uh, future videos, please put that in the comments as well. Uh, Cheers. It's not red wine, but man. No, no, but it does look like red wine, doesn't it? We don't need to tell anybody. We can upgrade. <laughs> that sounds like a plan. Yeah. What good plans. Yeah. So how long have you been in here now then? In this particular unit, uh, apartment, I've uh, been here since 1st of December 2020. Right, okay. Uh, well, didn't you live in this condo, in this building before that? Yeah, I took out a contract on a unit um, not too far away, across the corridor. It was a single bed, 35 square metre. Right. Uh, quite nice. That's the one you just showed me across there, which is about 10 steps away. Yeah, yeah? 10 steps away, yeah. Okay. yeah, yeah How much yeah. were you paying for that one? I paid uh, 10,000 a right, month, okay. 10,000 Thai baht. Was that a 12 month contract? Uh, six months I took that one out. Six months. Because okay. like, obviously when you come to a new condo, even though they look great, you uh, don't want to put all your eggs in one basket. Yeah, yeah. And yeah, okay. For a number of factors, as okay. you understand. So I took it out for six months. and um, But during that six months, I liked the unit. Everything was fine. The facilities were beautiful. Um, I did have an issue not with me because I paid my rent, power, you name it, every month. Yeah. But it's a renters beware situation where the owners were actually Turkish, so they weren't Thai owners, obviously. Right. Uh, after about a month, the managers, <coughs> management approached me, and luckily I introduced myself and they knew me and got on well. Yeah. And the owners hadn't been paying their yearly maintenance, which is about 20,000 baht. Right, okay. Like so with that, the management came to me and said, look, we know you're paying your way, but what the owners if the owners don't pay their way, we can't let, yeah. they can't let me use the pool or the gym or the steam room. Right, okay. So basically you can find the barracks. Yeah. Uh, Which is and I took it okay, and I said, okay, I understand what you're saying because there's nothing to do with you because I've worked in resort before. Okay. In Australia. And um, I said, all right, well, I'll do, I approached the agent and told him the story. Uh, but the problem was, being overseas, they weren't replying to emails. So, long story short, um, it took up a little while, but they finally um, paid up, but the management did come to me and said, oh, thanks for doing all the, the groundwork. I said, well, I don't mind that because um, I've been in that had before. With, with yeah, you understand the situation. Little, yeah, understand the situation, yeah. so. And I also needed a key to the safe because they gave me the wrong key and that oh, took okay. forever, you know, uh, for them to get back to the, the agent. So the agent was doing the right thing yeah. And getting back to me. So that was the problem. And then when COVID came along, uh, as it had at that time, I was coming up to my contract end. Yeah. And, and then I tried to negotiate the price from 10000 down to about, because I, I was a little bit angry, obviously. Yeah. I yeah. said, well, I'll only give them 8000 I said, I'll give them 8000 Right, okay. <laughs> and um, so this because, or, 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 Put in a washing machine for nine. So that one, most of these got the washing machine, but that one didn't have a washing machine. Right. Okay. So I had to go up the road to laundry, which was okay, which is, but yeah, but it's another cost and it's more hassle, isn't it? Yeah. So anyway, uh, long story short, there again, uh, they only came back with about nine and a half thousand. But in the meantime, I'd done my own homework and looked around in here. Yeah. 
and in the end they didn't want to rent it anyway. I think they might have got a bit um, annoyed right, okay. with why I went it. But that, but that's the way you 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 throw the darts. At the end of the day, you do what's best for you, don't yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, a little bit of payback, I suppose. And, um, and then they ended up renting it, uh, uh, coming back in the, herself, the lady. Oh, right, uh, okay. Yeah, she went back in there. But in the meantime, I was looking around here, I saw some nice units, 35 square. One was 62 square on the top floor. Right. They wanted, it used to be 25,000. Three quarters. Yeah, two, two better. The top floor on the corner, and uh, just to let your viewers know, uh, top floor in these parts, you're going to have a high air conditioning bill. Yeah, yeah. Very hot, yeah. very hot, yeah. because that, above that was just a, a um, it's like a mini golf course, and you've got the, the grey tiles, and right, okay. so you can understand it's yeah. very hot. And um, how much is that one? That was the uh, twelve thousand. It got 12, it down 000. to twelve thousand. Uh, they wanted fifteen. But a little bit of negotiation. Uh, so how did this one come about? And this one came about something? because I'd had a look at a couple of others, and one of the the agent who got me this one, it's through an independent agent, by the way, as it, distinct from the established type. That, that, um, it's something I learned in the time I've been here. Yeah. How they operate. I'd looked at another one. It's um, thirty-five square again. Similar to what I had, yeah. Higher four, probably two or three I'd look at. But um, one, actually one, <laughs> I looked at was, was an old air B and B one. Oh, the smoke, so much smell of smoke. And oh that. no, I didn't yeah, want that. So I didn't want that personally. Um, so yeah, I finally the the agent got back to me that I'd had a look at a couple of others in here with. And she said, this one's available. And they said 10,000. And I walked in here, as soon as I saw it, <coughs> I'll it take nice. it, I'll take it. Uh, because for me, it's, I know to a lot of people, it's 42 square, yeah. that includes your balcony. Yeah. Uh, it just had all the things on, I'm happy well, to. Well, it does, Yeah, it? I got that homely feeling and I felt comfortable. And, um, well, off so I took out, but I had to take 12 months deposit, uh, 12 months. Yeah, it took 12 months, yeah, but that's, yeah. that's not a problem for it you. It was a problem for me, no, no. We're talking off camera about the decor as well, isn't it? And it's, ni it's nice and it's, it's, it's not a brand new condo, but it's in really, really good condition, isn't it? Really great nice. condition. And as I said earlier, it's great management um, and they look after it. I, I forever see them working every day. Yeah. Every day. Yeah. But the good thing about here, also being quiet, is as you've seen, it, it's off Sawyer May and, and comes up onto like a, what we call a cul de sac. It's yeah. a dead end. Yeah. And it's away from the traffic area. So there's no noise. Yeah. And another big factor, uh, which I learned from other condos that I've been in, uh, it's not near an entertainment venue. <laughs> yeah. Right. Yeah. And um, and one of the others I, I was at one of the other condos had um, another condo under construction nearby, just right. about to go up. And so you knew that you were going to be and one <laughs> and that one also, <laughs> which I didn't realise when I got in there. Just over the road, it was a shooting range. So in an afternoon, if you're out there having a bit of tea or having a quiet drink, all you heard was shotguns going for the next two hours. Brilliant. Yeah, so it's a big factor. you just got to work out. You now, if people might like that, that doesn't bother them. But for me, yeah. I think I try to get as quiet as I can, you know, quiet an area as I can. The and good thing is that you've moved. You're, in, you're already here, so you know what it's like. You know what the building's like. You know clearly how good the staff are. Yeah, You've moved yeah. about twenty steps away from where you were. Got a room bigger than you were in yeah, with yeah. a washing machine. With a washing machine for the same price. Same so, price. Same price. So very happy with so, that. But this unit, um, I don't know if I mentioned earlier, last the pre-COVID was 
22,000 baht. Wow, 12,000 baht. So the, 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 that's what the reason I initially came here. Well, I looked at the, this um, condo, but oh, far too expensive for me personally. Yeah. Being the average, the average Joe. I mean, yeah. But very expensive. So twenty two thousand baht. That's a massive reduction. Isn't and it? that other one, as I said, was twenty five thousand down to twelve. Yeah. yeah. Again. Again. More than half. Yeah. 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 More than half. But another a funny story. Um, when I first came here to look, the first unit, I looked at uh, six months ago before going here. The, the agent. <laughs> we walked in. There was a, a studio, twenty nine square, and walked in, and this is when the lockdown. It just started, or well, well, thereabouts. Walked in, and I kid you not, I, there was just shoes, dresses, cosmetics, bed linen, and rubbish. Just unbelievable. It was just a mess. So obviously they up and gone. Yeah. And on a runner, and the poor agent. She's beside herself, so no, no, no worry, I understand. <laughs> I'm a girlfriend of mine, it's okay. <laughs> no, uh, so I had, I had a look at that, so they cleaned it up. It was in the not bad sort of area, quiet again. But I found 29 square a little too small. Right. But that was 8,000. And I still think that the studios, you can get them for about 8,000 here yeah. if they're available. But to this day, though, I still don't see too many people around. That's the other good thing about no, it. No, there isn't. There's, a, there's, there's not, not a lot. Of, people. There's not a lot of people. Yeah, 168 there. units here, and I remember looking on the site again prior to coming here in, in, to this unit. There was about 72 units up for rent. Wow. Yeah. So out of 168, you do the arithmetic. Yeah. So uh, sad times, really. Um, yeah. Yeah. But the good thing as distinct from the other condos, again, you can go up to the pool, which unfortunately we can't use at the moment because of the COVID, obviously. Yeah, we're I've not, been in the we're larger condos. Now. I've been in the larger condos and during the tourist season, you know, you get so many people from different countries in there and, and, and it's pure lack of discipline sometimes. They just go crazy. Yeah. Whereas here, it's more low key, which is hard to find, but it's out there. Yeah. Out there, but as I say, a lot of people wouldn't bother. It's just a perfect, you know, it's a perfect building, I think, isn't it? This is a perfect building, yeah. done well. Uh, yeah. For the uh, price as well. For the price I mean, as well. Um, it's quite, as you say, it's quiet. I mean, it is quiet in, in Pattaya anyway, but this yeah. is just a nice, quiet, in a coldy stack, as you say, and you've got the uh, the garden bit at the back there, so it's. Yeah, and the, perfect, nice court, it? the nice courtyard out the other side that you saw earlier, you probably have, you've got it on film. And, yeah. Uh, that's quite a nice quiet area there. Um, but yeah, it's got a nice gym and steam room and sauna. Right, okay. And, and a lovely outdoor area up there, which unfortunately we can't. Yeah, we can't go in there. Do you, you have some gym. pictures of that? I pictures. do have some pictures, yeah. Okay, well, but we'll I don't have pictures, pictures of the gym at the moment. Um, I've got a picture of the pool and just a couple of views. It's, okay. Yeah, it's yeah, possible yeah. I can probably get some yeah. from there. Uh, not overly big because being a, s a smaller type condo, it, it's probably I don't know as big as this unit really. Right. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's probably a bit. Well, this unit's forty-two square. I'd say in there would be around thirty square. Right. And got all the machines you really want. You know, get a bit of fitness. And all in all, I've just been so happy here. It's uh, all ticks all the boxes that I'm Yeah, I can see why. Um, yeah. Well, thanks for letting us look around. Yeah, no worries, mate. Really yeah. appreciate it. Yeah. And you're paying just so just to clarify, you're paying ten thousand a month, twelve month contract, and uh, one month's deposit. Uh, I tried to pay one month deposit, but unfortunately I had to pay two. Yeah, you're right. Two but but you can negotiate. You can get one month. You can get one month. Yeah. Like I paid on the other one, but. This was too good to pass up for yeah. me. I was, I was happy to do that okay. in the end. So, well, and, they, and they also put a safe in. I said, well, can you at least put a safe in? And yeah. they were happy to do that. So. Well, what I'll do is I'll put all that on the screen so everybody can see exactly what you're paying. Because as you said, there's more rooms here anyway. So if anybody's looking for a room, 
then they've got an idea of what they would be looking to pick. Yeah, and you can go through the independents on um, Facebook as well. Right. But uh, management have got a couple down there okay. also. Uh, but one thing you saw, I don't know if we mentioned it earlier, the security side of things, when we came in the lift, you saw, you probably had yeah. that on the video, we've got to have the key card. Key card, that's... I and mean, that I... only gets me to my floor. Yeah. And I've got to swipe it. There's most people have been in that sort of situation. I'm, I'm sure in other condos, but well, I've been and looked at quite a few now, and none of them have had that facility. And that is a great security. It is great. Security. Great for security, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Really good for obvious reasons. Yeah, <laughs> which we don't need to go into. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. But uh, okay, uh, that's all I can tell you, mate. I don't want to ramble on too much. But, that's great. Appreciate um, it. Thanks a lot. Thanks for coming and. Um, I hope your viewers enjoyed the Hopefully, chat. don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to like the video. And if you don't like the video, dislike the video and put any comments in that you've got about the condo or anything um, going forward that you'd like us to do. And uh, I would really appreciate it if you subscribe to the channel.